He just threw me home. Oof, that's it. I'm done. Let's not waste no time and get into your top stories for today. Did y'all see the new Super Bowl commercial with Hey Arnold? Well, he got thrown. But I do got to say, I did enjoy the commercial. Let me know what you thought about the commercial if you watched it. But I got to say, Creed in this commercial had me dying of laughter. <laughs> I had to look up the name at first to see what that translates to. It turns out it translates to Switzerland because Nickelodeon Switzerland has... Answer the splat. Now I have a question. Where are you guys getting these photos from? I'm just curious. Well, it's February and you know what that means. We are two weeks away from the 24th annual Low Winter Fest. However, I did notice one of the sponsors of that event. Okay, you see all these sponsors, right? On your screen. Look at Cobblestone sponsors. Out of the blue, the Massachusetts Pirates are on this list of sponsoring. That is something I did not notice while looking at the website. There's a few big ones on this list too. One of them being National Grid. You probably heard of it. TH McCoy Restaurant Group slash McDonald's? But McDonald's sponsoring this is wild. Does that mean they're gonna get free food? You know they're not gonna get free food, UML fan. Oh well, but there's a bunch of couple big names. We have a couple big names that sponsor like these events. Geico one time sponsored the Lowell Folk Festival, which that was not on my list. To like sponsor like an event here in Lowell, I think it's like around $500 to $1,000. Which I'm not paying for. And remember everybody, stay tuned for the Lowell Folk Festival video. And we have a first look at the Super Bowl live from the Bikini Bottom. The Super Bowl streams on CBS, Paramount Plus, and everyone's favorite channel, Nickelodeon. And here is your first look at the Super Bowl live from Bikini Bottom. I'm loving the setup. Especially you got the Splat logo in the middle. Wait just a second. I just noticed the background as well. That's painting the pirate in the background. So I wouldn't be surprised if the Super Bowl on Nickelodeon would open up with, Are you ready, kids? Are you captain? I can't hear you. Are you captain? Ooh. Okay, you got the point. You got SpongeBob TV in the background as well. You also got the Bikini Bottom mixed with Las Vegas as well in the background because I can tell. You also got SpongeBob and Patrick wearing headphones. That's kind of a bit weird, but they look great with it. And of course, you cannot have an NFL on Nickelodeon without Nate Burleson and Noah Eagle as well. So let me know down below what you think of the setup. Do you dig it? And are you going to be watching on Nickelodeon? Now, Nickelodeon also announced that they will be recreating Sweet Victory in CGI. So I'm wondering how that will come out. I hope it comes out good. And I'm really excited for that performance too. Also excited for Usher too. So let me know down below if you're ready to hear Sweet Victory at the Super Bowl. And finally, as of midnight tonight, Boston 25 News and all other CMG stations are going to be removed off of DirecTV. Now, if you do watch Fox like I do on DirecTV, you are urged to call this number and tell them to leave it on the air. Hopefully, as of now, a deal is reached. Well, guys, that's a wrap of this video. Thank you so much for taking time watching this video. And as always, I will see y'all in the next one. Peace out, my friends. And go Riverhawks. Hashtag the splat is back. Thank you all.